Well, hello there. Here we are on Wednesday, August 26, 2020, at 8.18 p.m. up here in northeastern Ohio. And tonight we have a new, well, a used Tamron 150 to 600 millimeter G2 lens. So we're at the 150 right now. And go up to 600. Now we are on the Canon RA camera. Since that's the only one I have left of the Canons. I sadly sent the R back because the uh, low light performance on this RA is so much better. But man, I love my R and I missed it already. Okay, and since we're recording externally, we can do the 5X and 30X of the focusing zoom. If you were recording internally, you couldn't do this on video. But there is the 5X which makes it 3,000 millimeters and it looks pretty decent there now we will do the 30x but it's not going to look too good now this will put it at 18,000 millimeters which is a further zoom than the P1000 gets but it's not going to be very clear And there's going to be more waviness than usual because we have so much humidity in the air. We had storms and rain and everything else uh, passing by. And it's going to be like that for many more days. So, as we stroll around here, that ridge is coming out pretty nice, huh? And if I didn't say it yet, the moon is 64% uh, lit. As we take a look at what I call the boneyard over here. The Giants, the Titans Boneyard. <laughs> I think I watched too much TV, huh? And the tip top. Oh my gosh, we have so much humidity. Look at the waves. And we get down to our light beam area and the mesa. And our question mark. And head on down. Hey, I went the right way that time. <laughs> well, that's quite cool. Whoa, that was a cool flyby. It looked huge. <laughs> and we are back down to the 5X, 3,000 millimeters. Yeah, I do wish this camera had a uh, 10X, a middle ground here between the 5 and a 30. But. No, I didn't bring any teleconverters out. Mainly because our sky conditions are so bad. But I am more interested in seeing how the two planets of Saturn and Jupiter come out with this uh, combo. Now I did have the 600mm RF lens, the Canon one. 
That thing's neat. It worked pretty well during the day, handheld, and it's very light. And the moon footage came out really nice too. But I couldn't manually focus on the planets at all. It, it just didn't make any sense. And that was such a shame. But that's okay because it's very difficult when you have such a uh, shallow field of view to find anything, even the moon. So even though the Tamron lens here is heavier, I like it better because I can zoom out to the 150 to try to find out where you are. <laughs> and at the moment we're at 180th shutter, F5. The ISO's at 2000. Okay, I had to relocate. And there is Jupiter, but... Looking up at the sky, I can't see a thing. And these clouds are not helping matters any. <laughs> oh, come on now. Give me a break, guys. Anyways, I wait for the clouds to pass Jupiter, if they ever do. The moon is in the south, southwest sky, and hopes of Jupiter cutting through there. It's not looking too good, though. Back on it. <laughs> Doesn't it figure? Now I had the same lens before. I think it was December of last year or maybe January of this. Okay, I can only see three of the moons around Jupiter, not the fourth one. Yeah, Jupiter's not going to come out too well here. It's such a shame. Like I said, I need a 10x. You watch, now I'm going to have to try to find a used Canon R camera. One that's affordable. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, so we can barely make out the bands of Jupiter. And just so we know, I can't even see the moon or Jupiter. And definitely not Saturn. Because of all the clouds. So I don't think, um... Hmm. I don't know, it'll be interesting to see. It'll be interesting to see if... We use some teleconverters and just use the 5x of it that possibly, even though it'll be small here on the screen, might come in better. I don't know. And like I said, the moon's been taken out. Saturn can't be seen even by jacking up the ISO here. So that's going to have to do it on this testing night. <laughs> but so far this lens is working pretty well. I got it from mpb.com and they listed it as like new. And that's the same place I got the well hello there. <laughs> and that's the same place I got the 50 millimeter f1.4. They're from Brooklyn, New York, so and that's where I sold some of my gear to and some of the other equipment I sold to KEH well look at that big cloud bank coming <laughs> now there's so much more important stuff going on in the world all those fires out in California and this big monster storm coming in in the Gulf and whatever else is going on in the world, wherever you guys are. So, I just hope for everyone's safety and bug out if you need to, please. Don't mess with Mother Nature. Mm -mm. All right, it's now 8.40 p.m. on our cloudy testing night. 
Y'all take care. Like I said, please be safe. Bye from Ohio.